Oh, we got black mans up in this bitch. Let's go. What is he doing? If I see one more character looking like this, I'm gonna lose my shit, man. I'm genuinely gonna lose my shit. So I've been on the interwebs and I couldn't help but notice we finally have ourselves a trailer for Acolyte, the latest Star Wars series. And if you don't know me already, I'm a Star Wars fanatic. Well, I, I can't claim fanatic because again, I haven't looked at the EU, but listen, man, I'm deep in, man. I'm deep in the void. I'm deep in the realm. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to get stuck in. I've been waiting to see what it was about. Honestly, I didn't even look at the teaser about the Acolyte. All I, I only looked at the title itself because I wanted to be surprised when this trailer came out. So it's finally time to get stuck in. Let's see what Star Wars has to offer, man. Let's go. Close your eyes. Your eyes can deceive you. We must not trust them. Oh, wait, is that the, um, oh, wait, I, I don't want to pause. <laughs> <laughs> is that the girl from Clone Wars? That that the green girl, or or did she die? I I thought. Well, actually, no. I'm bugging. Let me shut the hell up. Tell me what comes into your mind. Oh, we got black man's up in this bitch. Let's go. Yeah. Life. Balance. I see fire. Oh shit. Hold up. Hold on, wait a second, hold up. <laughs> Someone is Jedi. It doesn't make sense. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. This needs to stop. This needs to stop. Whoa, calm down, Jamal. This needs to stop. I promise you, on my name, there are more black hairstyles than the comb over locks. There are more black hairstyles. I promise you, if I see one more character looking like this. What is he doing? If I see one more character looking like this, I'm gonna lose my shit, man. I'm genuinely gonna lose my shit. My God, man, we gotta go back. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Come on, bro. Come on. Stop the violence. Stop the violence, man. I'm s man, <laughs> I'm so triggered by that, man. If you only know how many characters has donned that hairstyle since Black Panther, it's insane, man. Oh, we got some Wookiees. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I sense the darkness. I like her hairstyle, though. She looks dope in an age of light. Darkness rises. To use it. Okay. What is that? <laughs> Hold on, show me the darkness. Two episode premiere on June fourth. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Listen, we gotta go through this trailer. Bit by bit, we're gonna turn the audio off. Outside of the comb over locks, I'm very intrigued by this series, man. Usually, usually what drew me to a lot of the, the t anime, well not, f I don't even know how to talk right now. What drew me to a lot of the TV series for Star Wars between the movies was that they found a way to flush, well, flesh out the universe without needing Jedis or Sith or anything of that, or any force of that nature. But <laughs> this series is doing the polar opposite, man. All we gonna get is Jedis, so. Let's take a look to see what's going on here. We might slow it down a little bit. I forgot what that species is called, but I feel like we've seen a few of those throughout the series. I forgot the official name, though. We got a lot of younglings training and shit. So this gotta be like... This gotta be pre... Um, um, this gotta be like Old Republic type. Not Old Republic, but like Republic years type shit. Is what I'm gathering. Before... <laughs> Before my dude kind of went haywire, you know what I'm saying? Before he went a little haywire on the kids. <laughs> so this must be around that point. Or, with no context, this could be the old... Well, is it Old Republic? Or What am I thinking about? Is Old Republic where Clone Wars was? Or was that just the Republic? Because maybe I'm thinking High Republic, because imagine that shit. But, bottom line is, we still got younglings, we still got Jedis and shit. Which looks very good. 
right here initially i thought she was ahsoka the one girl that became friends with ahsoka in clone wars i know you know who i mean as well she had like the purple outfit she had green skin and a few dots and asajj ventress had to help her out with that shit but this is a completely new character she got locks and shit there's a lot of locks up in this bitch, man. You gotta, you gotta put some respect on it. They finally realize, and we got more than corn rolls and damn Caesar cuts. But listen, if we get one more comb over lock, I might actually burst a damn blood vein and lose my shit. The set pieces look very nice as well. So we got more action going on. And, and, no, nah, this is definitely Republic, because that's Coruscant, right? Th nah, nah, what am I saying? This is the Jedi Temple. Oh, but of course. I wonder the exact timeline of this though, like when does this take place exactly? And we got this one, I'm assuming this person is the Acolyte, I don't know, but they seem to be hunting Jedis. Um, now who has them hunting Jedis, I couldn't say. That's what makes me a little intrigued here, like who's this person working for? Hold on though, wait a minute. You know what I thought about? This could actually be after um, Return of the Jedi. Because maybe those scenes in the temple is flashbacks for this character, right? Maybe this is post Order 66. That's why Jedi's have to hide. That's why she has to wear the hood and, and blend in. So maybe this is actually, this could be like pre Mandalorian post um, Return of the Jedi. Nice little force push going on. And look at that hairstyle, man. I could respect that shit now. This is something I could get behind. You know what I'm saying? Like a different take on locks. It don't necessarily got to be a goddamn comb over. Shit. This June. Damn. Yo, I, I already said my piece with bro, but that one guy with the yellow kyber crystal, that's kind of legit, man. It's always nice to see a little yellow lightsaber. Now, this scene here, I wonder if this is like the Wookiee planet. What is it, Kashyyyk? Is this Kashyyyk? The CG here looked kind of off, to be honest. Like, And I'm sure you know what I mean as well. Like The, the person in the very front... It looks like in, 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 the intent is for it to go down a slope and then into the woods. But it also looks like those trees are like right in front of that person. It is very weird looking CG. This is the only part that kind of like threw me off a bit. This is definitely Kashyyyk though. Damn. We got like mind, re uh, mind wiping shit. Nah, I think that dude is the acolyte. Maybe he meets this girl and he teaches her the way. Yo, look at all the Jedis. This is insane. Nah, look at Queen, man. Look at Queen. Oh, lo, 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 lo. I like this, man. The representation in Star Wars has been immaculate over the last few years, man. Trust me. <clears throat> Is that an A-Wing? <coughs> <coughs> Shit. Who's that? Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Who the hell is that? I can't believe that dude got a comb over, man. Hold on. We got to go back to that one scene with the, the water. Who is this? That has to be who teaches this person the darkness. <clears throat> the dark side. Ah, oh, that's dope. Oh, shit, man. Listen, I'm kind of hyped, to be honest. I'm kind of hyped. It's always good to get new Star Wars. Like, I don't complain at all, man. This is the golden era of Star Wars. I remember those days when you had to wait like umpteen years just for a new movie for a new trilogy. Now we're getting all these <coughs> fuck, all these in between side stories and shit, filling up the gaps, filling the void, fleshing out the universe. This is what you like to see, man. As a Star Wars fan, I'm eating, man. I don't give a shit. Y'all could give me side stories all day, man. I'm gonna swallow that shit whole. Well, listen, I'm getting out of here, man. I got shit to do. Y'all have a good night. Peace out. Bye.